I'll be showing you how to generate and simulate HDL code from MATLAB. First, open the HDL code coder toolbox and then simply name your project as you like. We now require to write a function that we're gonna generate HDL code for. And this is a simple convolution function as shown. Just save it wherever you want and then in the HDL coder uh, workflow advisor just select the MATLAB function select the size of the input variables let, let the data type be type of double and then let us just choose it as a vector of uh, one cross five dimension next just generate a MATLAB test bench uh, we will write a simple test bench as shown let's just add the file here choose the file and generate workflow advisor now we have to first uh, perform the fixed point conversion tool which will just convert uh, the input data types to a fixed point type uh, once that is run validation will succeed and then proceed for HDL code generation choose Verilog check HDL conformance include MATLAB sources comments and generate report there are a bunch of other options which are not necessary for our purpose now. Uh, let us not uh, do anything with the optimizations and script options. And in the verify HDL test bench, generate HDL test bench, simulate HDL test bench, verify with co simulation, log outputs, and choose the GUI for HDL simulator. Finally, just uh, we'll have to generate the HDL code. So we'll just go to HDL code generation and then just click on run. Uh, ensure that your antivirus is disabled. Once HDL code is generated, you'll get a small report like this. Let's close it and proceed to HDL verification. Click on run this task and you really have to ensure that your antivirus is disabled let's just disable it for 10 minutes and now verify HDL with uh, test benches run this task run this task just wait till uh, the HDL test bench is verified uh, we can check out our uh, Verilog code now and verify with course simulation this is going to run an external uh, program that is uh, model sim simulator to verify our uh, generated very log code model sim is launched everything goes well Our waves uh, signals haven't been added yet, so let's just add the waves one by one. Just click on the waves to add. Add all the waves. Add the clock. Uh, the clock settings have already been set, so we can just add the clock. Uh, reset the input clock enable vector x and system function h let's also add the vector output which is of te dimension 10 so that's it add wave and we're done now uh, as you can see if you just uh, run the simulation we get the uh, test bench inputs that we just defined 0 0 1 0 1 0 0 1 1 corresponds to 1 2 3 4 5 and because the system function was an impulse we get the same uh, input as the output and you can clearly see it this verifies our design of convolution